Dyslexic Genius here. I'm back on the motor for the 4.3, and you won't believe it, the turntable is rusted onto the spindle shaft. So now we, if we can't get the turntable off, we can't get the motor out. So what do we do? Very easy. I've already pre-taken the governor out on a Victor, and then we'll take the spring barrel out. It has this little screw right here. brass rod not a lot of wear on that pull that out not a lot of wear not a lot of wear boom got the spring barrel off now what we have to do is get the spindle shaft out. So how are we going to do that? Because everything's going to be connected. I'm going to take the screw out of the governor drive gear. That little screw right there. Push down on the turntable. Oh, and now it's been turntable. Now that the turntable, you can see right here, there's the rust. See this? So what we now we can do is we can spray WD-40 here, let it soak and then spray WD-40 here and let it soak. Then after you do that, you can take the turntable. And clamp on this part in the vise. It's coming off the turntable. And now we can go tappy, tappy, tappy and get the spindle shaft out. Now all, all we have to do is undo this nut, this nut, and this nut. This will all pull off and then we can start the restoration. One other thing on, on Victor's. You ever see the big hump, like a hump, Victor II humpback? Well, that tells you right away that you have Ben Ben springs. Also on these, Some of them have screws in here that you can undo. This one doesn't. You can undo and then you can re-grease them also like an Edison. But that's all there is to it. So we'll soak, we'll soak the turntable with WD-40 and hope it does its magic or something else. And we'll pop that apart and then we'll have to clean all that and flex on the hole into the turntable to get rid of the rust so everything will fit back together nicely. And that's my tip for the day.